Welcome back, people. Thanks for all the love on my first vid. Even if you were lying and you said it was cool, appreciate it. Literally, if I'm doing this video for anybody, it's my grandma because she said it makes her feel like she's part of my day and that's what we're here for. I would do it, I would make a video every single day if it made my grandma feel the slightest bit of happiness. So here we are, today, the goal. My dog is right here. Oh, by the way, if you don't know me, my name is Tori Schaffer. I am 24 years old, married, living in Richmond, city apartment, little five pound dog, living life. Okay, loving it. Goal for the day. Uh, we are going to, I think we're gonna go to the container store. It's my first time there. If you're not there, it's basically like organizational heaven. They have a container for literally everything you can think of. I've watched countless YouTube videos, countless TikToks about like what I need, what I should get. I'm going in with an open mind, I'm gonna let the container store just kind of inspire me for what we need in our apartment. I'll show you some of the things are, some of the things in our apartment are like, they work, but they don't work, you know? Like it's just kind of existing. Like I want some sort of like organizational scheme behind it. So we're gonna see what we can find. Um, let's do it. Over here, we're gonna get a formal introduction going. This is Odie. He's a Maltese. He's really upset that I just picked him up from his nap. He, obviously his hair is pretty long right now. It will be cut next week. This is how he gives hugs. Okay, moving on. Lucky for you guys, I already did my makeup so we get to skip that on this video. I just asked Alexa what the weather was like and she said it is 89 degrees. For what reason? It is August. I was gonna wear some cute pants that I just got, but because of the weather situation, we're gonna go with some shorts and probably a literal t-shirt. Can't do the staple button down today because I think I'll just sweat through it and take it off like I did in my last video. So let's see what we end up with. Pit check. We have brown and white tank, doesn't match, don't care. Green shorts, probably the last time I'm gonna be able to wear them. Um, and I really like them, so we're doing it. I've got Beja's, Beja's, Mark Jacobs tote bag. If your question is, why is this part of the fit check? I need to vacuum my car, mind your business. Thought it might be cool to show you guys like what I take in my bag with me on a regular trip, so let's show you. I always carry a claw clip, um, just like on the handle part, and then I've got this spray, which just like, if you know, you know. Um, this new wallet, which my husband just bought me, and I'm obsessed with it. Lots of storage. I've got like seven pairs of glasses because why not? Setting spray, this um, lip balm. Let's see, Laneige, Laneige, however you say it. The peach, absolute vibe. AirPods, gum. Let's see, we've got essential oils, digize because hot girls have stomach issues. Gluten digest, also because hot girls have stomach issues. And then just like apartment, car keys, stuff like that. And then always, always, always emergency water. couple that we were there to celebrate is so deserving um they are perfect for each other oh my gosh they were so much fun as a bride and groom um and it was so nice to see people from home and like celebrate like their victories and you know spend time with them and love on them um the only downside was that I danced so hard that I got three separate foot cramps and they were brutal y'all I mean I literally I had to sit down and take a break because I was like will I survive this like I don't know um but it was wonderful and Pennsylvania is a lot prettier than I remember it. So shout out to you. It's right next to a Barnes and Noble. Send help, do I go? Why did nobody tell me? I know 
know that nobody's really shocked that I bought things here, but the store was really cool. It was a little overwhelming at first, but I really enjoyed my time. Here's where I really decided between like looks and aesthetic. I don't know. This just wasn't the vibe, so I went with the basic. Plus we're in an apartment, so like we don't need something nice. Apparently you can create your own closet at this place. I thought that was dope. Maybe one day. Here's a few other things I snagged. Some of this stuff didn't work, like I'm gonna have to take it back. And that's okay. Trial and error. But my most toxic trait is that I normally don't return things. So we'll see if I actually return them. And here we go. So bags secured. I'm super pumped. I spent enough that I got a free tote bag. You know what it is. Anyways, um, I think I'm gonna go home, have dinner with Paul. He's making dinner as we speak. Love him, top tier husband. <clears throat> So then I'm gonna try to incorporate some of this stuff. Number one item that I'm most excited for is like a dish drying rack. We have a dishwasher, but sometimes we just wash the dishes because we feel like it. And my husband washes the dishes, but he just sets them on a paper towel for them to dry for multiple days. Which, if your question is, well, that doesn't make sense. Correct. So I bought him a like a drying dish rack. So that way at least it has a purpose, like it's sitting there drying. And then I'll just still put them away as I always do. Love that for everyone involved. So I'm gonna head home, we're gonna make dinner, eat dinner, and then I'll show you guys how I incorporate these into the crib. That's pretty much all we had planned for today so thanks for watching if you have any other suggestions or things you would like to see feel free to hit me up or leave a comment below uh, be sure to like and subscribe and thanks again for watching